It's the champ, Shannon the Cannon, two-time heavyweight champion in the world. And you're watching Sports Icons. Subscribe. Let's go, champ. Let's go, champ. Let's go, champ. Champ. Okay, so since the weigh-in for Andy Ruiz Jr. and Luis Ortiz, I've had quite a few messages, which is, do I think Andy Ruiz Jr. has had surgery on his chest? Now, I'm gonna give you my answer in a minute. So what I've done was I looked at it and I zoomed in on it, as you guys can see on the screen right now, and I'm thinking, maybe, I don't know. So what I've done was I looked at the second Anthony Joshua fight, and a little bit of a faint line under the left breast, if you can call it that. Faint line. But again, if we look at the Chris Ariola fight last time out, you can see, again, it's quite faint, but there is something there anyway. There is. Now, when you look at other pictures, you can see Andrew is Jr. when he's not posing, he's just relaxed. You can see that's where his chest muscle or chest fat, however, comes down. So obviously that would just be a natural crease as some people will have, okay? But at the same time, if you are gonna have surgery and you need it anywhere on your chest, that's probably where they'll go anyway, is where the crease line is. So it is possible that he has had surgery, that is for sure. But what kind of surgery would he have possibly had? I mean, that's open to debate, isn't it? I've heard people say liposuction and whatever, but liposuction, you just have like holes in you, wouldn't you? But at the same time, at the same time, it could be, it could just be that he's wore a black t-shirt, a dark t-shirt, which of course he was before he took it off for the Luis Ortiz weigh-in. And it's a new t-shirt. We all know if you wear um, new t-shirts and you're sweating a little bit, especially if you just bought some dark underwear, you go to the gym, obviously you sweat a little bit and then you look at your nuts and go, hang on a minute. Or covered in black fluff what's going on it could just be that okay so it could actually just be a a crease of where his uh, folds would normally be and some black fluff has got in there to make it look much worse than what it is that's what i think it is that's what i think it is because i have looked online to see has andy rich jr had surgery and the only surgery that pops up is back in August of last year. So just over a year ago, he had surgery on his uh, right knee. I think it was right knee or left knee. I, th I think it was the right knee. But I haven't seen anything about anything else. But if he has had surgery, I mean, firstly, that would explain the intense layoff that he's had. It would, obviously, while he recuperates. It would also explain why he signed to fight Luis Ortiz and then tried to jump ship and go fight in a Triller card against Torren Spong before the PBC pulled him back, went, no, 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 you've got a contract with Luis Ortiz, you need to fulfill that one. Because obviously Tyron Spong, that's a much easier fight, right? But anyway, I suppose it's open to interpretation. I'm led to believe that it's just a case of, that's just where his uh, breast muscle was, like, or is, the crease of it, and it's just like a bit of black fluff, to, which has made it look so much worse. But hey, listen, if he has had surgery, what kind of surgery could it be? Who knows? Who knows? Maybe he was just... I don't know, removing some fat bits or, I don't know, getting some breast augmentation put in there. I don't know. I really don't know. But, I mean, I would ask Andy Reese Jr., but he hasn't really spoken to me since before I was uh, petitioning for him to get the uh, Anthea Joshua fight the first time around. He was quite chatty with me then. Since then, he hasn't bothered. Hey, this is just boxers, okay? You get used to it after a while, so I can't ask him. And, of course, a bit late in the day, hours before his fight, so you're not going to be asking him. Anyway, listen, that's my thoughts. You drop me yours. Click on the subscribe and I'll catch you all on the next video.